Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back. So, welcome to another Monster Super League video. Now, today I'm going to be doing something just a little bit just for fun. Um, I'm, I don't really need the Geminis, but I'm going to be raising one, you know, anyways, kind of just for the Astro Gems. You actually do get quite a lot of Astro Gems, I'll show you in this video. So, I actually have two light ones. I probably will raise this one because this one has two square slots, so it is definitely superior to the other one. And for, as for the other one, I'm, I'm probably going to make it like a variant Evo 2 or something and then use it for next Rebirth Festival. I think that, that that's a pretty good choice. And I really don't want to make this one a variant because it it looks better. Like the, the non-variant version um, of the Gemini, the light one at least, looks a lot better than the, the variant version. So I'm going to try to keep it as a non-variant. And it doesn't really matter too much because they only have um, resistance and chaos towers, so it's not really all that important. So we're just going to do this and we're going to get it to um, we're going to get it to Evo 3. Now this is definitely worth it in terms of gold if you if you take a look right now because um, basically like evolving one of these or evol evolving the light one if you feed 3 it costs 90 and then 70. Well, I'm not I'm not going to do the math right here because I like need to get out a calculator because my my uh, my calculation skills are pretty pretty damn horrible um, <laughs> but we're gonna like you know because these ones are like evil or, or not evil um, they're three star monsters meaning that you can get them to or evolve them relatively easily so or or a lot cheaper than than four star monsters and you still get the reward of um, making this one evil three as the you know like you still get the astrogen reward of making that one evil three so i'll just show you right here i'll make this um evil three or i'll, I'll do this really really quick um make some evil two ones Ooh, the fire one has a really nice color scheme i i really do want to maybe just like collect all three of them just for for collection purposes i i really love the design of this you know doesn't get better than Double lolly. All right, this is just like sliming. You <laughs> go out and then you collect it. Um, and we'll do three more, and then this is basically just enough to make it evil three. Now you don't have to collect the quest for this one um, right away because the one for making it evil three um, is a separate quest. We'll take this light one and then we'll feed the three fire ones to make this one, this light one, an Evo 3. Alright, finally got, got it to Evo 3. Man, they look super cute. Holy shit. Um. Alright, so basically you get you get 20 Astro Gems. From from this, like you get a hundred astrogens from the quest, right? You get twenty from this, and then if you go to the light one, um, the evil two and evil three versions, you get sixty here and hundred and eighty here. So it's definitely worth it in terms of the astrogem gain um, from the gold spent in order to make them evil three. So even if you don't need them at all, it's still recommended that you make you get them to evil three anyways for the extra astrogens. Um, and completing Astro Guide because they are they are natural four star monsters and they have um, like what's even better is they have three star counterparts so it's even cheaper for them for you to get them to Evo three. Um, the other thing is there's gonna be, there's actually a new event I don't have enough points for this one but this one's already almost ending like in three days this was a pretty good event it it did give me a lot of random free shit. All right it's not not too lucky today. But you do get some like you know free gold and stuff, so it's not too bad. Oh, we'll take a look at the other event. This one only lasts 18 days. Oh, this is pretty rough. So you got to send a gift to friend a hundred times for this, um, 800 times. So that takes you 16 days for you to do this. Wait, and the event only lasts 18 days. So if you miss like two days, you're fucked. Yeah, if you miss like two days, you're you're completely fucked. Um, you won't be able to complete this. Is there like a complete completion award? Alright, so you get a light dark egg and a legendary egg from this as well, so it's not too bad. Um, you did, you get a lot of Astro Gems. You get 50 here, you get 100, and you get 200 here. So you actually get 350 Astro Gems from this guide, or from this, uh, from this reward. 
What did I say guide? Um, you also have to cast Gemini ten times, not too hard. The This one's actually quite annoying. I, I really don't do Guardian Dungeons a lot. Sometimes I, I do them, sometimes I don't. Um, most of the time I don't. And uh, the, the other really cool thing is like the Holy Gleam. I think it basically if you complete this, it gives you like a free Holy Gleam. You'll need all the pieces in order to summon a Holy Gleam. It's probably going to cost 100 because it adds up to exactly to 100. Or maybe you only need 50. Imagine if you could get three Holy Gleams from this, it would be pretty, pretty damn amazing. Um, so I think the hard one is just Clan Battle, because you have to do it 24 times. Um, meaning that you can only do, you can only do six a day. Wait, you, do, you can do six a day. So you only need to do this, um, wait, wait, wait. Oh no, you need to do Clan Battle 90 times. Wait, what? You need to do Clan Battle 90 times. And then you can only do 6 a day, so like, 90 divided by 6 is 15, so it takes 15 days for you to do this. Um, damn. If you miss 3 days, you're fucked. Actually, it's not too bad, you shouldn't, you really shouldn't be missing 3 days. But, but this one, like, make sure to send your friend gifts, because if you, if you miss 2 days, you're, you won't be able to get this legendary egg. So make sure you, you begin now. And I think I fucked up by... Oh god, I already sent shit to my friends. God damn it. Alright, um... Well, that sucks. Dang it, I sent it before the the event started. And I also caught those Geminis before the event started. But I guess I'll still be catching more Geminis anyways. So it shouldn't matter too much. Now, the other thing we're going to do is we're going to do a few rebirths. I, I really don't know if I have anything to rebirth. Now, um... I actually made the decision. Maybe you should gen this up. Just just kind of for fun. See if I have any like random HP gems I can throw onto her. I really don't, to be honest. Probably put on a protection set. I don't think I have a lot of life gems. I do have one here. Actually no, I, I probably have a whole bunch of HP. Alright, we'll just do that. I think that's I think that works. I'm Probably not going to be using her, but I'll I'll use her just for fun. I'll, I'll raise her when I'm bored, when I'm like really bored. Damn, I, I really I really like the design of this monster. Not not because I'm a lollicon, but because um this monster is designed very very well. Just like how can you not love double Magical girl. Oh, all right. Um, let's. Oh yeah, well, I was talking about like completely giving up on fusion. Um, I really don't think I should be fusing any more Victorias. I, <laughs> I can't afford to do it, and I don't think like raising a light Anu or a light Shiva really helps me either. Like I, I don't have the resources. I don't have the gleams even to um, make an evil three Shiva. I kind of want to use my gleams for other monsters like Valks, purses, and stuff like that. Um, or Indra's stuff that would actually really help me. I'm I'm kind of planning on like raising some of these like um, Courageous Strike monsters to Evil 2, like the 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 Water Siegfried, the two Water Indra's and stuff like that. Um, I'm planning to maybe use Gleams to like kind of get them to Evil 2 to boost my damage in clan battles a little bit, and yeah, I think that's I think that's pretty much it. Um, so I I do actually have enough Victorias to make another Victoria Evil. Evil 3, but I don't really think it's going to help me too much. Originally, I was planning on using two Victorias for Golden's B10, but that was before I found the, well, like, I, I kind of came up with the, like, the full attack sapper strat um, for <laughs> for Golden's B10, and that's definitely a much, much better strategy. Um, and I'll be, I'll actually be showing you guys some, some of the, some, uh, I'm, I'll be borrowing a friend's rep to show you guys some, some cool, like, double Miho action um, in a later video today as well. So I think since I won't be able, I won't be doing any fusions anymore. I'll probably keep the wolves. Uh, maybe eventually one day I'll do the fusions. But inventory is not going to be too much of a problem if I start like rebirthing sirens and cocos and stuff. Um, so yeah, that's I think that's pretty much it. I'm just gonna rebirth a few, see how many I can do, and I'm probably not keeping the mihos either. Although I should probably check if there's if they have like good, very good variant skills. Oh, this one's only level four. I need a level 6 one, like I need a perfect leader skill. Alright, since they're not perfect, we're gonna feed them. 
Don't need the Sirens either. I can't feed that one. I guess we'll go with the Cosmo, and then we'll see if we can get another variant Coco. Um, or better yet, I get Lightning and I get a variant, like, Dark uh, Gemini. That, that could work as well. Hmm, didn't even come out as a variant. It's a little bit unfortunate. Dang, I'm, I'm out. I'm done. Holy shit, I thought I was... I thought I had more. <laughs> I thought I had more to rebirth. Um... To be perfectly honest, I can start, like, taking out these sirens as well. Don't really need them either. Um... These two are like triple square bets. I don't know if I should. I don't know if I should feed them. Can you? I can use this fire Gatito that I raised to Evil Three, kind of for the Astro gems. Also for like completing the Astro Guide, but I, I think I'll keep it. I'll take a Siren out. We'll we'll use that one. I'm seriously giving up on on, on fusion now. It's it's way too expensive. Like just it. I, I think I'm at the point where I don't really need to do it anymore because I I don't really need another Light Victoria. The one I have now is perfectly fine. So I guess I'll just keep that one. Alright, didn't really get anything from this. Um, can't really summon at all. I'll probably save up for, for Heroes Fest. So yeah, that, I think that's pretty much it. I'm going to go back to farming now. Um, just wa kind of wanted to share the moment where I <laughs> like make a Evil 3 Light light Gemini. Um, thinking, I'm, I'm thinking hard about like if I should raise them. Like, I really want to raise them, but I, I don't have a lot of resources. Actually, no, that's a lie. I just, like, I don't want to use my resources. I want to <laughs> I want to get more Astro Gems and, and wait for Heroes Fest and stuff like that. They, they won't really help me progress, because I already don't really have much to do. Um, but yeah, we'll, we'll, do, we'll do, like, a PvP battle just kind of for fun. Feels like I haven't done that in a very, very long time. Also, my, my music thing, like, fucked up, so I'm just playing music from YouTube. I used to have, like, that window above me. What is this bullshit? What. The. Fuck. Alright. Um, I think this is balance type, right? She's tank type? She's quite annoying. I could actually... Actually, they, they have no threat. We'll... We'll take this out first. We'll, we'll send three, see how much damage it does. I think she's balanced. Or maybe she's tank, I can't remember. I know she's defender, so... Ooh, holy shit, that's a lot of damage. Mmm, we'll take her out. Alright, it's just a water Arthur. We'll probably kill the Arthur first. And then after I kill this Arthur, we basically win. Damn, I kind of want to kill Light Purse. The shock is going to be annoying. All right, we'll, we'll we'll finish off. We'll kill her first. My Cupid probably should be able to tank this. Ooh, but he got sealed as well. It's kind of annoying. I I have to heal up, even though he's sealed. This was a actually a pretty tough fight. If he got luckier, I might have I might have actually lost. So this, this is a pretty this is a really strong defense. I mean, they do have like full nat fives and like two light dark, so it, it's only fair. What should I kill first? Um, the Odin's kind of too tanky. I'll kill the Nightmare first. Nightmare seems much much easier to kill. Ooh, that was annoying. All right. Motherfucker. Spamming attack down on my face. You know, this this actually would have been a really hard fight if he had a variant Odin. And had the variant Odin as lead instead of the um the Dark Valk. Ooh, that, that was that was actually a little bit rough. Um, yeah, I think I I'm almost 
almost, uh, I'm climbing really well, so I should be able to make it to Heroes 1. Like, it's not going to be a rush this, this, this week, um, to make it to Heroes 1. I should probably summon these eggs as well, I might as well do it. Maybe I'll get something nice. You never know, it could be a nat 5. Man, I haven't summoned in so long. Like, I, I just went weeks just farming for Dragon Sigils non-stop. Like, I haven't been farming Golems at all. It's completely... Completely... Um, left Golems untouched for two weeks. Alright. So, yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. Um, I think I caught a lot. I'm, like, number one in Capture League now. There's no... <laughs> Like this is, this is this is getting pretty insane. He does have more legendaries than me. I mean, he has better luck than me, but I I guess I grind harder than him. Um, but anyways, that is pretty much it. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll I'll see you guys in a later video. Um, I'm gonna be testing out like the another like the new strategy for for Golem's B10. It's gonna be really really sick. Um, you know, hopefully it's gonna be really sick. But anyways, uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.